Come on into this conversation that I'm having with my family and friends during the barbecue at 4th of July weekend. Hey everyone, it's Nick McLean, owner of the Nick McLean Real Estate Group, and I'm having these conversations in private with family and friends around the barbecue at these family gatherings during the summer time that we're all getting together. And people are asking me, Nick, what's changing in the real estate market? What are you seeing happening? Are homes really not selling? They're coming to me and they're asking me the same questions. And this is what I'm telling them. I'm telling them that it's the first time in 10 years in Wenatchee and Chelan and Leavenworth that we've seen in North Central Washington where the number of new listings and the number of price reduced listings are the same. In fact, some days there's more price reductions than there are new listings. And you have to take this in context. There's more new listings coming on board than I've seen in the last three years, at least pre-pandemic. I haven't seen this many new listings. So there's a lot of new listings and equally that many price reduced listings. So what's happening? Well, homes are sitting on the market longer, right? Uh, last two years, homes would sell in a day, two, day, two days, two weeks, three weeks, sold. Average days on market, under 30 days. Now, we don't even know what the average days on market is because it hasn't actually formed yet. Does that make sense? Interest rates went from three to six. Homes are still sitting on the market that were listed before interest rates went up. So it's day 45, it's day 60 right now, and the sellers are wondering, what's going on? Why hasn't my home sold? I would like to get more feedback. Talk to the buyers that looked at my home. Why aren't they making offers? And you know what it is? It's, it's price. And so they're lowering their prices. They're trying to find out what price will get their home sold. We don't know. A lot of these homes don't even know what their home's really worth. And so you have these homes on the market that price their home based on comparable sales six months ago when interest rates were three. And now interest rates are six and they don't know what it's really worth. So they're, they're doing price reductions. Nobody's freaking out right now because the price reductions they're making are really off of higher comps anyways. So they're just lowering it to a more reasonable price. They're not freaking out yet. But as soon as they start having to reduce their price below what they thought they were gonna walk away with, and well below what they thought they were walking away with, they're gonna start freaking out. Don't freak out yet, we're not there, okay? But what I am also seeing is buyers are taking advantage of this. Finally, buyers are saying, finally, I'm in the pole position. Finally, I have leverage. And sellers, you've been getting 10, 20% over list price too long. I'm gonna come in 5% low. So we're seeing offers on homes, 5% low, 10% low, because buyers have a little bit more leverage, right? So that's where we're at in the real estate market. Well, what do you do about it? Well, you know, hiring the right agency with negotiations, strategies, and expertise, hiring agents that know how to price homes in today's marketplace, hiring agents that have marketing to find buyers with cash that aren't being affected by interest rates. It's so important right now. It's so, so important. And so if you wanna know what your home's worth, you need to talk to us. You need to talk to the Nick McLean Real Estate Group because we're factoring in true values, true pricing based on comparables in the last 30 days, not the last 90 days. You don't need to be told what you wanna hear. You need to be told the facts. So reach out to us, click on the link, find us on our website, and I'll talk to you